Hey guys, I got me an oil catch can for my 95 Honda Prelude. I'm gonna do a little review on this here, also insulation, and actually put it to the test to see. You have an option of either put a filter on on top here or use it without. I'm gonna do tests of both to see if it's gonna smoke with the filter on it and to see if any oil is still going. So, I got me this clear hose for the demo to see. Got it from Home Depot. I'm gonna be installed that to this so actually you can see you know, what's going on. So, yeah. Just beware guys, the dipstick here to measure the oil level that catch in the can, it doesn't go all the way down to the bottom. So, you only go three quarter way. So you're gonna get a, like a quarter of a can oil that catch in the can over here before it actually started to read. All right, let me show you guys what this looks like inside. I'm gonna remove this. It's actually come apart. See? Then this also separated in two pieces. Got me a piece of L bracket, cut it down to size, so make a mount. I mount mine right here next to the battery, so it should be clear when the filter is on. So, yeah. Just gotta get a hose, run it over there. Okay, guys. You got it hooked up here, the in over here. So I just put the white foam here to see. You know, and that's out over there. Go ahead, start it up. So five minutes and I'll check the seat. Okay, apparently the heat took a little like three minutes. So the whole turned it in on white. Okay, I take the filter out and put the cap on there. And apparently now we start to get some oil building up there. Now give us some gas. Give it. Give it.
Alright, I'm gonna let this run for five minutes and check it out, see what's happening. Alright, guys, I put two clamps up there so there's no like vacuum leak on the hose, no air. So, but there's a problem here now. You see the hose. Look. The vacuum on it, you suck it in. So. Yeah. Apparently I have to get a new hose and try it back. Okay, we're gonna try the hose that come with it to see. Go ahead, start it. To see if it's gonna turn flatten, crimp up. Yep. See, it's no good. Turn flat. You see the vacuum? <laughs> Hello. Turn it up. Let's see. See? Start it up. Start it up. Alright, that's it. Turn it up. Yeah, guys. Apparently, it's not working even with the hose that they sent. As you can see in the video there. You know, it's no good. It's just crimping up. You know, turn flatten. So, yeah. I'm gonna have to get some more stiff hose connected and see. What's going on? Okay guys, we're finally getting back to this project here. We was using the um, half inch by 3 8 So we're going now with the 5 8 by 3 8 So it's much thicker hose. So, yeah. As you can see there, see the difference? Hopefully this um, 5 is not going to crimp up. Alright, let's get to into it. Okay guys, here I go. Put the hose there. So let's see what happens now. Later on I'm going to try to move this, the can closer over there. Alright, go for it. Let's see. Looking good so far, it's not crimping up. Alright, let it run, come. My assistant says that. Check him out, he's a YouTuber as well. Five Adam D. Alright. Alright guys, it is March 2nd, 2019. So I'm gonna drive that around a couple months or like a month and see what's going on with the, uh, how much oil you know is in the pan. So yeah, this is what the car look like. And the place turn nice. I'm gonna do a lot of work to the car, a lot of gauges have to go in there. So. There's no vacuum leak over here, but I'm gonna still put two clamps there, you know, just in case. So, yeah, got two over here. So far the hose looks like it's holding up really well. It's not crimping up or anything. That's a good sign. 
Hey guys, we decided to wrap this video up and um, yeah, we're gonna come out with part two of the oil catch can. All right, because I want to drive it at least like two months to make sure you know function properly if we're gonna catch enough oil and stuff like that. So, yeah, we're gonna be a part two coming out. All right, guys, bye, bye. take care, bye. See you, kid. As I said, check him out, 5 Adam D. Alright, bye. Yeah.